All right, class, what we're going to do is we are going to be utilizing the next two pages in your composition book. They're going to be the left page, right page. And on the left side, I want you to make a big bubble letter F. I know that this page is sideways, but I just wanted you to see it. So it'll be the entire page. It'll be the F. And then on the right page, I want you to make a giant A bubble letter and have that take up the entire page. What we're going to do is take some notes in and around our letters and find way to find uh, information about the Federalists and Anti-Federalists, explaining who they are, who, who supported them, and what did they want. Uh, so we're going to start with our Federalists. So at the top of this page, write down Federalist. And they supported the Constitution. Okay. These were our supporters of the Constitution. Now, the difference between the Articles of Confederation and our Constitution is that uh, it strengthened the executive branch. So they liked it because it had a strong central government with a strong executive. Now, uh, what we're going to see is that they want this, and there are two main supporters. The two main supporters we have are um, are Alexander Hamilton and James Madison. And he is our father of the Constitution. Now, as being a father of the Constitution, he was the one that wrote the Constitution. Uh, just so you, you know what that meant. All right. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to have that completely out. Uh, what we're going to see is uh, the Federalists, they are going to be the ones that go through and really want to have this whole idea of the Constitution. They uh, don't believe in a Bill of Rights. They believe that the Constitution should it has those rights in there, uh, grievances we had against the uh, British, and that they're they're in there, they're mentioned, but there's no need to go through and to write out all the things that you have the rights for. To support this, they are going to write something called the Federalist Papers. To support uh, the Constitution. Uh, it encouraged uh, states to ratify it. The three main writers were Hamilton and Madison, and also we're going to add over here another supporter. Uh, well, we won't add it, but another supporter we had was um, John Jay. But this is all the key information that you need for the Federalists. They were supporters of the Constitution, wanted a strong central government with a strong executive. The supporters were Alexander Hamilton and James Madison, and they did not believe in the need for a direct Bill of Rights. Now, on the other side of everything, we had the anti-federalists. And so we have anti-federalist. Now, this prefix means they were against. Now, they were against the federalists. These are the people that believed in the opposite direction. They wanted no central government.
They liked it under the Articles of Confederation where the central government was very weak. Uh, they believed it should be states. We like this fraction right here. States over federal government. They wanted to make sure that the states had more power than the federal government did. They wanted to have a limited executive branch. That means that the uh, president today would be very limited in the power that he have. Uh, and really, uh, just to add over here, um, states, uh, states were very powerful. Now, the two main supporters that we have for the um, anti-federalist, uh, they are going to be Patrick Henry excuse me let's mark that out spell it out better we're gonna have Patrick Henry and we're gonna have uh, George Mason uh, they are going to uh, be going through they wanted uh, a big thing they want is a Bill of Rights and uh, they're going to go through and write uh, the anti-federalist papers where uh, no constitution without a Bill of Rights. Um, they're going to say that really also that the uh, government would only serve, uh, they were worried the government only would serve the, work, the wealthy. And so they were going to go through and make sure that they could take care of everybody. Uh, eventually, what's going to happen, and we're going to write this here in the middle of our two papers uh, with the dots, is they're going to compromise to add, excuse me, a Bill of Rights. to the Constitution. All right, that's everything you need to know about the Federalists and Anti-Federalists for right now. Uh, go ahead and finish up your notes and be ready for your further instructions.